Hi everyone. I've decided to make an online shop. And today we'll be talking more about the things that got into it and how far I've gotten as of now. It's not a really difficult job, but it is challenging because there's so much to keep track of, even for me, and I love doing these things. This video actually helped me put everything in place. I used the common mnemonic that I learned in school. I don't remember for what, but it is who, what, where, when, and how. I feel like there are many ways I can categorize this, but here's a good way to share what I've been doing so far. Enjoy. For a much better angle where you can see me. Okay, so let's talk about who. Who is making this site? I am making this site. But I get by with a little help from my friends. Uh, the greatest success of a solopreneur or a freelancer is their community. And I really want to make use of mine because I know people who can help with the legal aspects, the financial aspects, the technical aspects. And I'm so grateful that I have that ability. Even my patrons have made it possible for me to just put in a little more effort into the site uh, instead of trying to um, manage client work, etc. So I am thoroughly grateful to the community. I'm not doing this on my own. I am learning from other illustrators and their experiences. And I'm very glad that it's not just me, even though it's my business. <laughs> Excuse me. Let us also talk about what I am doing. I am building an online site, an online shop, and I'm gonna sell um, products that I make. I'll talk more about that in another video. I did want to name my site uh, after myself. It was Natalia Rebecca Isaac, a domain that I had purchased some time ago. But now I'm realizing that nobody knows my name and there is no indication of what I do in that website name and I did not think about search engine optimization four years ago and so I want to change the name of the site. So uh, let me know if you have any ideas because I've been meandering trying to figure this out to no avail. Let me know perhaps an artsy name. Help me out. Put, put something in the comments below. The next thing is where. What is where? I don't know. I am building the site on the internet. The next thing is when. By the end of March. Uh, right now I am doing a March Meet the Maker conversation on Instagram and so once that's done it'll be a great segue into uh, talking about this site because the last day's prompt is going forward if you want to see more of that you can click on the description and head to that um, but I had initially wanted to release this site on my birthday which is the 6th of March but here's the thing my sisters and I we share uh, one week with our birthdays all in one week. What am I trying to say? My sisters and I have our birthdays in one week. And so every year it will be a hustle between celebrating birthdays and managing the online shop. And so I figure that I should give myself a little breather. I don't want to be chasing deadlines in this birthday week. And so I have decided to release this at the end of March. However, my patrons will still receive um, this site link well before it's released to everyone else. And how am I doing this? Wow. So I'm doing all of this with 
daily to-do lists of a bigger picture of what I need to do. I have smaller workable goals and I'm just getting things together bit by bit. And this is why it helps to have friends who know more about things that I have no idea about. So some of the smaller big the big smaller tasks include designing the layout of the site, making products to sell, printing products and stocking them up for the day I get my first orders, making my own font because that's a cute little detail. Drawing all the banners and page links, writing copy for each page, making sure I have payment methods in place, getting legal approval for all the payment methods, making sure I have packaging that is eco-friendly because I'm conscious of that. And it also includes talking about the site and posting things on social media like this. You are part of the process. So that's all for now. That's what I have. I'm going to be focusing on making the site. I wanted to make this video uh, quick and easy because I've been spending more time making videos than I have been on the site. And since we're getting closer to a deadline, I would I would really very much like to finish that up. And so once that's done, I'll be back to making videos, sharing all of the products that I'll be selling and other cool things that I am making. So um, you remember to check it out when, when the site comes out and also actually tell me suggestions for names in the comments below. Plus, thank you. See you next week. I am going to make a website.